Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another top 10 videos and today I will show you guys the top 10 city tweaks compatible with iOS 10 up to iOS 10.2 part 17. Smart tap. This tweak allows you to wake up the screen of your device simply by double tapping on it. You can also lock your device. All you have to do is just like double tap anywhere here on the blank spot on the screen and you can lock your device as easy as that. So if you jump to the settings of this tweak, you have here a bunch of gestures that you can configure and what you want to do with them. So you enable it here and then you have, you have here when screen is off. So you can choose here what you want to do. So when the screen is off, you can go to the gesture and pick an action here. You can also enable here when screen is on. So double tap on the home screen to lock the device and also double tap on the lock screen to lock the device. And also you can enable here smart touch detection. So it will detect like false touches and won't wake up the screen of your device. Just take a look at how cool the messages app looks. This is translucent messages. It will add this nice translucent look to the messages app so it will have a, a kind of like blurry look it looks pretty dope so it's a bit transparent so you can see the wallpaper behind the app the home screen the wallpaper here on the back it looks pretty cool under settings all it has is an enable button where you can enable or disable the tweak 3d light this is a simple one for the widgets here on the home screen and also on the lock screen notification center and also for the 3d touch menus as you can see it will add a light theme to them so you can see they have like a white background not the blurry background that you have on stock ios the tweak doesn't have any options to configure send delay now how many times you have written something wrong or you wanted to send a message to a wrong person so this tweak gives you time to cancel it you can see here if i want to send this message click here you can see it will turn red and now I will have time to cancel it. So tap on the button here while it's red and it will cancel the message. So if you go to the settings of this tweak, all you have here is this slider where you can set the duration of the delay. So you can set up to five seconds of delay. So you have from like 0.1 up to five seconds of the delay of sending the message. Aqua board. This is a fun tweak which will add this like water animation to the home screen and to the lock screen of your device so you can see you can swipe like this or you can touch your screen to see these awesome animations and also if you go to the settings of this tweak here is where you can change that animation so let's open settings here so you enable it here you can enable it for home screen and lock screen and then here you have this theme so you have different animations that you can choose from Clear notifications one tap. This is a very useful one for the notification center. So you know on notification center you will have to tap the X button once, then it will say clear, then you will have to tap clear to clear a notification. But with this tweak all you have to do is just tap once and you can clear a notification. Message filter. This tweak allows you to filter your messages based on whitelisted words or blacklisted words. So what you have to do is just open a conversation tab here and then you can go ahead and choose a blacklisted word tab there to add the word tap add new here add any word you want and then you won't receive that word on the messages on that conversation message heads this tweak will bring these kind of like facebook chat heads to your ios device so you will see these icons once you get a message from someone you will see this icon which you can access from anywhere on your device so even if you're on the home screen or on an app you can see it and you all, all you have to do is just tap on it and you can go ahead and take a look at the message and you can also reply to them just tap here and it will show you the keyboard and you can reply to that contact if you want to dismiss it you just tap there and you can drag it down here to the x button to close it so here under the settings of this tweak you can enable it for the messages app you can enable it for whatsapp and then you can change its appearance right here and also the behavior so you have a lot of settings here to configure for this tweak no wi-fi when run this please so this tweak allows you to turn off the wi-fi when you open a certain app so you can use only your data with that app so you enable it here and then you can pick the apps so here i have picked the messages and you will see here once i go to messages i open messages you will see here it will turn off the wi-fi so this app 
can only use the cellular data. So let's go back to the settings. Here you have also activator gestures. So if you go here, you can pick an activator gesture to invoke this tweak. Pickpocket 2. This is a very powerful tweak to protect your device from thieves. So it will add a bunch of features that you can use to protect your device. For example, this one right here on the lock screen. So not every time someone will steal your iPhone, maybe sometimes you will lose it and someone will find it and they can just tap here and then they can call you or they can email you directly here from the lock screen. So this is very convenient, very easy to use. So let's jump to the settings of this tweak. So as you can see here, let's go to settings. We have an enable button and then you have all the options. So you can see a bunch of options here. I won't go through all of them, but you have a lot of options here like shutdown options. You can choose if you want to protect the shutdown. So someone steals your iPhone, they can never shut it down until the, the device is out of battery and stuff like that. But as you can see here, a lot of options to choose from and to customize Pickpocket 2 based on your needs. So that's it for this video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it. For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe. Also don't forget to follow me on my social media, you will find all the links in the description of this video.